Hello friends, welcome back to another video of Automation Testing Insider. So today I'm going to talk about what you mean by error, bug, defect and failure. And this is an important interview question guys. So if you are new to the software testing industry or if you are a fresher and if you go for an interview. So people or interviewer might ask at the time of interview that what do you mean by error, bug, defect and failure and what is the difference among them. So generally uh, some of the terms we use interchangeably in the software industry so that's why people are getting confused while answering the, uh, this question so let's talk about them in detail so let's talk about error first so what is an error so error is a uh, error is a mistake made by developer while writing the code or in other words i would say error is a programmatical mistakes done by developer while writing the program so what are the different types of error we may face while writing the program? So we may have syntax error. Let me just write some of them. We may have syntax error. We may have compilation error. Compilation error. We may have runtime error. And we may have logical error. So these are the different types of errors we may face while writing the code guys. So if you talk about syntax, so let's say suppose I want to print something in the code. So suppose I want to print hello and here we have, I have missed the last parenthesis. The second parenthesis I have missed in the code. So that leads to syntax error in the program. If you talk about compilation error, so uh, if you made some mistakes like syntactically if you made some mistakes in the code or if you have written some wrong statements in the code so that leads to compilation error in the program so we are not able to compile our program if you talk about runtime so in runtime what happens is we are successfully able to compile the code but we are not able to run the code because of runtime error so what are the examples of runtime error guys so suppose we divide any number suppose we divide any number by zero that leads to runtime error or another example could be suppose we uh, we have given reference of any missing file in our code that leads to runtime error or suppose we are calling any invalid statements uh, sorry invalid function in the program uh, so because of that we will get runtime error so these are the different examples of runtime error guys so in runtime error what happens is we we are able to compile the code but we are not able to run the code because of runtime errors and if you talk about logical error guys so let's say we are developing a software and for some functionalities we have written some logic and if we made some mistakes there then we we will not get our expected outcomes so that is logical that is logical error and these two runtime error and logical error leads further leads to defects in the software because we are not getting the expected outcome so that is defect which we'll discuss next so these two leads to defect in the software so if you talk about uh, so this is all about error guys uh, if you talk about bug and defect so these two terms are used interchangeably in software testing guys somewhere we are using bug and somewhere we are using defect it depends on companies to companies and project to project guys and in some tools we used to say bug and some tools we are used to say we used to say defect as well so these two terms are using interchangeably but what do you mean by bug and defect so if you see any deviation or difference in the uh, in the software with respect to expected result and actual result if you see the difference in actual results and expected results or expected outcomes and actual outcomes so that is nothing but the bug or defect so let me just give you an example now developer is developing a software guys now unit testing is done now they have given us the software for testing purpose they have released a build to this testing team now in this software we have we are testing the login screen so we have username password we have two fields username password and submit button the bill uh, came to us for testing that software so we are testing it so we are testing the login screen here we have username and password and this 
यूजर नेम शुड टेक एज पर द रिक्वायरमेंट इट शुड टेक अल्फा न्यूमेरिक वैल्यूज अल्फा न्यूमेरिक वैल्यूज गाइज अल्फा न्यूमेरिक वैल्यूज बट वाइल टेस्टिंग इट इट इज टेकिंग ऑनली अल्फाबेटिकल वैल्यूज सो दैट इज नॉट एज पर द एक्सपेक्टेशन सो दैट इज अ डिफेक्ट वॉट वी विल डू विल वी विल रिवर्ट टू द डेवलपमेंट टीम वी विल रेज अ डिफेक्ट इन दैट केस वी विल रेज अ डिफेक्ट बिकॉज अवर एक्चुअल एक्चुअल आउटकम इज नॉट एज पर द एक्सपेक्टेड आउटकम सो वी विल रेज अ डिफेक्ट इन डिफेक्ट टूल सो दैट इज अ डिफेक्ट नाउ वॉट अबाउट फेलियर लास्ट टर्म वी हैव हियर फेलियर सो वेन वी रिलीज द सॉफ्टवेयर टू द एंड यूजर वेन वी रिलीज द सॉफ्टवेयर टू क्लाइंट एंड इफ दे फेस सम प्रॉब्लम्स दे फेस सम इशूज लाइक द सॉफ्टवेयर इज नॉट एज पर देयर एक्सपेक्टेशन सो दैट लीड्स टू फेलियर इन द सॉफ्टवेयर and end user will use it or while testing the application they will face some issues or problems so that leads to failure in the software now how do we relate error bug defect and failure so let's say this is error and bug as i have discussed earlier we are using interchangeably these two terms and here we have failure failure now error leads to the bug and defects in the software bug and defect leads to failure so error we have spoken about runtime error and logical error because of that we got the defect and because of the defect let's say suppose we are not able to catch that defect in testing environment and we have released the software to the customer So that leads to failure in the software so this is the relationship between error bug defect and failure guys so this belongs to this error belongs to developer developer this belongs to tester and this uh, failure belongs to customer yeah so this is the difference between error bug defect and failure guys and this is how we can relate these terms and uh, if you like this video please share it and if you are new to my channel then please subscribe it guys so this is all for today thank you so much have a nice day bye bye